hello and welcome to the birthday gift this message is for sagittarius sun moon rising and venus okay sagittarius i want to go ahead and jump right on into your message see what message they have for you please give me a message for sagittarius okay um you have reason to celebrate Sagittarius, there's a reason to celebrate, and you know why? You finally completed something. Uh, you just made a huge leap in your journey here. And you should be in a good mood. I'm feeling like things are getting better. Okay. Yeah, you're in a new cycle. The world is the last major arcana of fool. Your overall energy is the first. You're in new territory here. You should be acting a different way. You should be doing things a different way. You should feel different. You should feel very good and optimistic. Okay? Now, you will have to do things in a different way. Now, if you come into this new, this newness, Doing things the same way you've always done it. Do not expect different results. Okay? All right. Let's keep going here. Yeah, transformation has occurred. You're a different person. I hope, I hope you recognize this. Sagittarius. Very important. Because this is what happens. Time and time again. A major milestone is met. Cycles are completed, closed, and it's, it's like a successful completion here. You know, you feel different. You're a whole different um, mind, mind frame. You think differently. You realize things you didn't realize in the past. This means you went through a very, very tough lesson sometimes. Um, but you come out stronger and you're you're totally different. You went through that that death of the old and you've transformed into something totally different. So the universe gives you new opportunities. Try doing things a different way, looking at things in a different way. Now, if you get this far and then you decide to act the same, accountability, okay? Because you're being given a clean slate here. It's going to require you to take some risk. Uh, you know, do new things you've never done. Things you haven't considered. You might want to start looking at your belief systems. You know, I've been doing this. I've been taught to do it this way. It has not worked for me. Okay. Let's see what else we got. Yeah. Okay, so the Seven of Pentacles is here. So this lets me know it's not going to be like easy peasy. There's, it's going to require some work, some effort. Okay, you're going to have to be disciplined. Things might um, be moving slow. You might feel like, you know, change is not happening. Oh, just know it is. They want to see how much, how bad do you want it? How bad do you want it, Sagittarius? Uh, at the slightest, slightest hint of conflict, do you run and buckle? Or does that make you try harder? Basically, are you ready for this? Because there's something major, huge, trying to come in. This is not small. This is not little stuff here. I mean, the big, the first card and the last card, that, that means you went through a whole, all of them. You you went through all the major arcanas. All the energies has presented themselves to you in your past cycle. You've ascended. You've completed it. Now you're back at the beginning, but in a new cycle as a different person. Now, it's time to start putting that work in. It's time to start putting that work in. Now, if you 
expecting it to be handed to you on a silver platter. You're not ready for it yet. You're not ready. You're not ready. Okay, because what they're trying to bring in, it's huge. It's not something small. So you have to. You have to show that you're ready for it. So there will be tests. There will be temptations. There will be doubt. There will be uncertainty. There will be fear. As this new, as this new person who you are in this new phase, in this new territory, you have to understand that you can, you can take that. Those are not barriers. Those are not obstacles you can't overcome. Those are tests. So you got to keep going. You got to try harder. That's when your victory comes. That's when you start seeing things turn out in your favor. That's when people start seeing you for who you truly are. You, the recognition here. I'm telling y'all, there's something you're going to be celebrating. I see you receiving your accolades. I see some of you guys public recognition here. It's like you being noticed, you being uh, appreciated, recognized. People like people around you, things around you, they're going to see you in a different way. You're going to start to shine here. There's there's a there's things happening. OK, what you are, you're on your uh, spiritual path here. Eight of Cups, you are on a spiritual journey. You had to walk away from something. Okay, they had to take you away from something to get you here. Um, whatever you just left was a huge part of your transformation. And this wasn't easy, actually. Some of you are still dealing with the um, residual effects of whatever it was that you that you moved away from. So that sometimes still bothers you, but that's fine. You're going to be okay. You are evolving here. And uh, you need to be working on... There's a something that you're supposed to be putting your energy and effort into. It's, a, it's something personal to you. It's It's like a... A gift you were given. Three of Pentacles. Please tell me more. Why is the Three of Pentacles here? Oh boy. I just saw. <laughs> okay. We have the devil here. Oh, that temptation. I'm telling you, y'all, it's... It's, it's, um, it's like you still have things that's lingering. So you will have to deal with those. And the best way to overcome many of those is if you have some type of hobby, something you love to do, something you're passionate about, that's where they're wanting your focus. Some of you, you may have addictions, And a lot of you, that may be what you just overcame. Maybe addicted to something, whatever it is. Um, to overcome that, you want to start focusing on your creativity. Uh, things that you just love to do that just make you, that put you in a good space. Because the devil is lurking here. Okay, now, there is a possibility for a relapse. Some of you guys may be going back to something or may want to go back to something. The Three of Cups is here. Could be a person. Some of you just walked away from a person. And you're tempted to go back. I do see the uh, reunion card here. Okay, now. Oh, my goodness. Some of y'all dealing with a Capricorn. 
you can you can overcome it look at look at this devil card you can overcome this this is you breaking free from those temptations this is you letting them know that you don't fear you don't fear that you can conquer that you have the strength to overcome those this is your victory yeah you're not gonna let nobody take away this victory from you come on now because of temptation you're gonna pass all of this up this huge leap because you're tempted You know, just because you want that instant gratification, you want that temporary feel good, you're going to pass up all of this. These cycles takes years. They take lifetimes to get through these cycles. You're going to let temptation make you go backwards. Really? You can conquer this. This ain't going to hold you down. You got, you have, uh, you have your guides around you rooting for you. You better stay on that straight and narrow. You better stay on that straight and narrow, Sagittarius. You're in a new territory. Remember, you're doing things in a different way. You better remember that. All right. <laughs> you know, this is the, uh, the king. People don't play with this one. The king of swords. You don't play with this one. Some of y'all need to start putting your foot down and the decisions that you make, you need to make sure that they're final. When you detach from something, you've detached. Period. Some of y'all has an energy. It could be an air sign. Um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. It's uh, it's latching onto you here. Very tightly. Very tightly. All right. Um, right now, what your guys, what Spirit is saying is you need to start, um, you need to rebuild yourself. Start working on your craft. Uh, what they're trying to do is bring in that sense of security uh, the sense of uh, structure into your life. So you may be doing something new, like a new business, maybe going back to school, learning something new. Uh, there's a lot of stability, security that's going to come in for you. Now you are at the beginning stages. That's why it's taking a lot here. You know, a lot of dedication, hard work, determination, discipline. Okay. Um, but they need you to stay focused. You you will be tempted. I, I'll tell you that right now. You will be tempted. I'm going to pull two more cards. Um, could be by someone. Some of you, is, it's something. It's a habit you have. You have a habit. There's some kind of thing that has a... I don't want to say a hold on you because I feel like you've already released that hold. But it has an attachment to you. All right, your your sense of security, that's what this new phase in your life is about, okay? Four of Wands. That sense that you, you have what you need, materially, emotionally, all that. This is like home, feeling at home. In life, basically. Feeling like, okay, this is where I need to be. I'm not where I want to be yet fully. I know I'm still growing, but I'm I'm okay. I understand the process. I'm getting there. Yes. And here you are. So you could do it. You're going to do it, actually. Um, this is you being able to take control and, um, and conquer this stuff. There's nothing you can't, um, you can't overcome. Not with what's being laid out in these cards. You can overcome all of these energies. Now, it's going to come hard. Yeah, but you can overcome it. 
Don't doubt it. There's somebody who's still um, affecting your energy. Some of you have somebody. King of Swords, please tell me more. Queen of Cups. Somebody you may have been love, in love with. So, okay. This uh, person has an, uh, an effect on you emotionally. There were feelings here. There was love. There's a, there's a connection that you had to detach from, from someone. Okay. Water signs are showing up as well. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But again, you can overcome this. And I think that's your weakness. This person can actually get to you through your emotions. Be be aware of that. Be aware of that. Okay, because I see a reason to celebrate and I see a victory. Three of cups. Why is three of cups here? Yeah, the will is turning in your favor now. The will of fortune is here. It's been reversed. Some of y'all are finna go backwards. Yeah, listen. Okay, I don't really have to say too much. The way things are going is the way that it should be. Don't get back on that cycle and go backwards. Okay, don't do it. I'm going to go ahead and do the extended, but I'm going to pull an energy oracle card first. See what energies you should be paying attention to. Your seventh chakra. Wow. Somebody else got this same card. Your crown chakra. Enlightenment. I'm telling you, this is, uh, who got this? Was it Libra? It's like all this high vibrational energy here. It's like you're ascending. You're, you're, uh, you're thinking and seeing things in a different way. You, you've ascended. Okay. Your seventh chakra here. It deals with, uh, knowing who you are, letting go. Letting go of that facade that you're you're taught that this is who you're supposed to be. This this shows that you are now aware. You are enlightened, okay, and you're on your spiritual path, and you're growing it as well. So just keep going. Trust that everything that's happening is happening the way that it should. I actually see you overcoming this. I do. And then the extended. I'm going to see what else you need to know concerning this. Okay. So uh, any guidance, any advice they have, we're going to go ahead and uh, and pull on that for you. Okay, Sagittarius? Okay, so I'm going to leave it there. And uh, I hope this was helpful. Okay, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Look at that. All right. They're reiterating, <laughs> man, this is like warning you, listen, you've already done the work. Do not go backwards, period. Okay. All right. They need you to keep moving forward. Look at that. That's where your success is. The chariot. Again, 